Hi, everyone. This is Ann Klemmer and Stamper from StamperDog.com. Wow, I know it's last minute, but this is a, such a cute little project with kisses and witches hats, and you can have it ready in just a few minutes with your big shot. I cut out two circles with the circle framelits, the fifth and sixth largest ones. That biggest one is two and three quarter inches. And then the biggest one, I'm going to take my trimmer and make sure you use the closest to the cutting edge because I'm going to push that circle all the way down so that it's centered and look at perfect cut in half every time. So I'm going to put one off to the side and then I'm going to get out my special unsticky mat <laughs> just in case I go off the edge and I'm going to use some fast fuse. Don't want to use glue because I'd hate for it to get onto the, um, onto the kiss at all. So I'm going to go all around the curved edge and only half of the straight edge, kind of like a G, I guess. Uh, and I'm going as close to that straight edge as I can. And I don't want to go out over, but come on, they're going to rip it apart and eat it anyway. <laughs> now I'm going to start rolling it on the straight edge that does not have any glue on it. There's no tape on it. I'm going to slowly roll it up and kind of when it gets in the middle I want to give it an extra little bit of encouragement at the tip of the hat because that's really where you want um, all the edges to meet. If it doesn't meet exactly at the bottom edge that's okay. We're going to take care of that in just a minute. This could be a wizard's hat at this point. Uh, but now I'm going to take about three inches of ribbon, maybe a little bit more and I'm going to put some fast fuse all over that because I'm not going for neatness here. Now, if you want to put glue on it, it probably would work better. But like I said, I don't want glue by my candy kiss. Um, and if you do, that's okay. Uh, so now I'm going to wrap it around the bottom of the crown of the hat and then just kind of ease it in there because, you know... It's just a little bit wider at the top than it is at the bottom. That's the way the crown is, and the ribbon's not the same. You, know, you could probably take rubber bands. <laughs> I mean, whatever you like, because I'm going for something quick and fun. And now we're just going to take the scissors and clip off any excess. And golly, it's even sticking to my finger. That fast fuse is pretty strong. Now, if you would like to know anything about the supplies we use today, just go and look down below because there's links to everything. If you've got a big shot, great. If you don't have a big shot, you know, we can help you get one. And at the end, we're going to have a link to uh, a whole lot of other big shot video projects that you can learn how to use it. And I put the fast fuse in the middle of the uh, uh, flat part of the hat, and there you go. And if for some reason your kiss doesn't come all the way down, then just put a Stampin' Dimensional in there instead. Isn't that great? It's something fast and fun, and your little goblins are going to love it. And look, at we've got a half a circle left just to make another one. This is Ann Clemmer and Stamper from StamperDog.com, where we try to put a little ink paper and fun into your day.